The Sentinel project is a quality improvement program that's been developed by Hull University Teaching Hospitals Trust and the University of Hull and by AstraZeneca working together with primary care to improve outcomes for asthma patients. So in asthma we recognise that patients often become reliant on their blue reliever inhalers but they provide temporary but short-lived relief from symptoms. It's really important when people have inflammation or developing the symptoms that we use medications that contain inhaled steroids which get to the core of asthma, treating the inflammation and therefore preventing asthma attacks. Working with the HSN has been absolutely fantastic and has really been very important in allowing us to scale what we've started to do in Hull and East Riding across the rest of the country. One of the interventions of the Sentinel project is focused asthma reviews for our patients. So those patients that are at most risk of poor asthma outcomes. So we will bring the patients in and review their asthma kind of top to bottom. So looking at diagnosis, current control, so we'll assess symptoms, whether they're wheezy, if they've got breathlessness. We look at triggers. We also look to optimise medication should they need to. We saw many patients move to something called maintenance and reliever therapy. And this is a therapy where the patient will have an inhaled corticosteroid preventer and also a fast-acting reliever. Both of those medications sit within one device. Historically, I've always had hay fever. Year on year, it just slowly got worse. Became asthma probably in my 30s. I've been in treatment ever since. I was maintained pretty much all the time with a blue inhaler. I was okay with it. I wasn't wanting to change it, but the nurse suggested that I try the combined therapy so that the causes of me feeling poorly were going to be dealt with. Within days, I could see the difference. I'm not worried in the least not having my blue inhaler anymore, because I know that the combined therapy will actually treat my symptoms. The Sentinel project across Hull and East Riding has allowed us to reduce the number of blue reliever inhalers that are being prescribed for patients with asthma across the region and increase the number of people who are appropriately being treated with inhaled corticosteroids. And the vast majority of these inhalers are what we call pressured meter dose inhalers. And those are the type of inhalers that have quite a high carbon impact. By better controlling asthma, reducing our reliance on blue reliever inhalers, we can significantly reduce the carbon footprint of our asthma care. One of the things that we're really proud of at Yorkshire and Humber Academic Health Science Network is that we're working very much in partnership with the Sentinel project. And where there's the willingness with the clinicians, we can offer now the tools to support them to do it. And the main role of the AHSN is to spread and adopt good practice. So if we can do that for Sentinel, then that really would be fantastic. The Sentinel project was initially implemented in Hull. And it's had such a huge impact. We're now seeing that this project is scaling out nationally. So working on the Sentinel project for me has been probably one of the biggest achievements in my career. We're making huge changes, changes that have been needed for a really long time hoping that this continues to expand and continues to benefit patients.